Hi, I'm David Daniels, author of Look What's Missing. Did you know there are three words missing from 35 popular Bibles that make Jesus Christ into a sinner or worse? My book lists 250 examples, but this one will make you sit up and take notice. It's about Jesus. Is it a sin to be angry? 35 popular Bibles say it is. They have taken out three of Jesus' own words and turned him, God the Son, into a sinner. Look for yourself in Matthew 5.22. Here it is in the Green Bible. No kidding. Verses on the environment are in green. But I say to you that if you are angry with a brother or sister, you will be liable to judgment. So if I'm angry with someone, I'm liable to judgment? That's what it says. Okay, let's say this and 34 other popular Bibles are right. It is a sin to be angry that we'll have to give account for in the day of judgment. What about Jesus? He was very angry, twice. The first time in John 2, he made a whip out of cords, chased out the money changers, the sheep, and the oxen, poured out the money, and overthrew the tables. That sounds like anger to me. The second time, listed in Matthew 21 and Mark 11, he also threw out the buyers, knocked over their seats, and wouldn't let anybody even bring a vessel through the temple. Let's face it, Jesus was angry, twice. And according to 35 popular Bibles, Jesus was a sinner. But was Jesus sinning? Of course not. Let's look at Matthew 5.22 in a real Bible. But I say unto you that whosoever is angry with his brother without a cause shall be in danger of the judgment. Oh, so it's only a sin if you're angry without a cause. Jesus had the perfect cause. His father's house was being made a house of merchandise. And furthermore, it fulfilled prophecy. Read John 2.17 for yourself. 2 Corinthians 5.21 makes the doctrine clear. It says Jesus knew no sin. But 35 popular Bibles say Jesus sinned twice. If you have one of those Bibles, seriously, get a new one.